thickies welcome back to thick girls guide and in today's video we are going to be going over my walmart haul um so most of it's like kitchen stuff um if you've seen my video on their clothing to me that's very hit and miss but i think their their kitchen stuff is pretty um spot on and they've got some really good brands and items and all of that and really surprising finds that are really great quality so if you are into that stuff definitely stay tuned and don't forget to hit that subscribe button join the thick girl gang and give this video a thumbs up now let's get into it The first set of stuff is from the brand called Time and Table. And I was walking through my Walmart Supercenter one day and down the kitchen baking aisle. And I saw this set of baking dishes. And it came with a set of two baking dishes. So this is a smaller one first and it is just so stinking cute. So it has this like beautiful gold metallic um, around the top part here. And then also just very simple, very black and white, just the, the lines um, going down the side of it here, has time and table stamped on the bottom here. And just really good quality, really hefty ceramic I think um, obviously oven safe dishwasher safe made in China um, oh it's stoneware and it says it's safe up to 450 degrees and then this is the larger one which is my favorite sorry these are hefty <laughs> but this one has like just little polka dots around it again that same um, gold rim here but overall so cute so this is like the 9 by 13 size and then that other one is um, a little bit smaller let me see if I can hold them up here together okay so this one really if we set it inside that's the difference in the two so the set of two is less than $30 so super, super good deal, again, for very aesthetically pleasing, just something different than a standard baking pan, um, which is honestly what I was looking for. And actually, I didn't know I was looking for it. So I just found them and I was like, I can't not get these, you know? <laughs> so overall, just freaking adorable. And then the next thing that I found is the to kind of go with it it's the square this is a i believe it's a nine by nine let me pull up the dimensions so this is the nine by nine square baking dish and now it has a different design on it. it's got those geometric triangles still bringing in the cohesive look with that black and white and that gold rim also same thing on the bottom stamped with the time and table. Overall, I thought that was a great addition to my little collection here. Then they also have, I haven't bought it yet. I'm probably going to, but I'm going to put a picture of it up here, but they have a pie dish. And do I really ever make pies? Not really, not very often. Um, but there's every once in a while where I want to use a round baking dish and I would love that it all kind of goes together and is cohesive. So the pie dish is just under $15 and the square is also um, about $15 as well. So honestly, like with how cute these are, I would honestly expect these to be more expensive. So I do appreciate at Walmart the low prices for this, for the quality that you're getting. This is stuff that is definitely going to last. If, if it was chintzy and cheapy, honestly, I wouldn't be buying it. Also to piggyback off of that whole collection, 
they have a set of two ramekins and just like the two baking dishes one is got that striped with the little gold rim and the other one's polka dot um, i've got two sets of these so four little ramekins total for ramekins i actually use little dishes like this very frequently if you find yourself wanting to make a souffle you definitely can but the other thing that i really use these for are like appetizers like dips and sauces um, if you're doing a charcuterie board you know like if you want like let's say some olives or put some honey or whatever in these so these make fantastic additions to things like that these are pretty big so for like a dipping sauce for just one person this is probably too big where like you know a normal ramekins about about that big so this is probably three four times the size of like a little dippy dish but if you're having a party these are these are f so perfect okay so that is it for the uh, time and table cookware. I will link it down below. They also have dishes, which I've been eyeballing and I'm like, do I need more dishes? No. Do I want them? Yes. <laughs> uh, so I'm trying to hold off with those but we shall see but they are they are adorable like they are just so stinking cute i just love the aesthetic so speaking of things for charcuterie boards if you haven't been to walmart in the the kitchen area they really have upped their game in that department and they have beautiful charcuterie boards and they are pretty reasonably priced for what you're getting so this one I picked up the other day and I just think it's stunning. I love the kind of like brass gold kind of handles here on either side. The wood grain is absolutely stunning. This is from Better Homes and Gardens. I think it's, I think it's acacia wood. This is $23. It's like a little bit less than that. This is hefty, like she is thick. I love that it has this smooth kind of dip that it goes down here. I did notice that one of these, cause there was probably about four or five stacked, one of them had a split. So definitely inspect your the one that you're picking out. But overall, like this is absolutely gorgeous for only $23, such a steal. The next thing that I picked up are just these very, just very basic, very clean little appetizer plates. And these were only like, I think they were like $2, a little bit under $2 a piece. So super, super inexpensive. And I believe they're just ceramic. I don't know. I don't think they're porcelain, but they are just very like sophisticated and kind of just plain which is what i wanted so that the the food that you're displaying would stand out on them for two bucks you can't beat it so i got three of these these are also from better homes and gardens and it's about five inches by ten inches this way and I haven't found them online. If I do, I will definitely link it below, but I did find these in store randomly. So the next series of stuff <laughs> that I'm gonna go into, I am completely obsessed with right now. It is the Pioneer Woman glassware. So I was in the store and I first saw it in uh, a teal color. And they were these little, like, kind of like when you're prepping the little tiny dishes where you can put like your seasonings in and then you just toss it in or whatever. So we used those in the um, Super Bowl video that we did. If you haven't seen it, definitely go check it out. Still some great recipes for parties. So I, I got four of those and I thought they were so stinking cute, but they also had larger bowls. So I ended up picking those up so the small ones are at my mom's house since we use them for the Super Bowl Sunday video. I just left them there. But I then went back to see if they had more of the little ones. They were sold out, but I found the large bowl. So I love, love, love the one, this color is beautiful, obviously. But two, 
just the embossing. Um, and then it does say Pioneer Woman on the bottom. But I got four of these. I think these are so stinking cute. These are primarily going to be used for our cooking videos. But I thought, how cute. Um, you could also use them for appetizers, obviously cereal. Um, or whatever you eat out of a bowl, I'm sure would be fine as well. But I am obsessed with this design and this kind of vintage glassware that she is coming out with. So then, maybe me, shopaholic, um, <laughs> I went online and I was, I wanted to see, first I was looking for those little small, uh, I don't, I guess, little, little prep bowls, I guess, is what I would call them. And then I noticed the butter dish. Y'all, I had to order it online. I have not found it in stores. It's got my little wedge of butter in it. <sighs> Adorable, okay? And this is like hefty. This is well made. This is giving me all the vintage vibes in a new and modern way. I am living for it, y'all. So with the butter dish comes of course, the little salt and pepper shakers, which I wasn't mad at because I just, I have an obsession with salt and pepper shakers. So this is the set of them. Has just like the little regular top there with the little, so you, it doesn't say which one's salt and pepper, but you can see through it. So I feel like you don't need that. And these, again, hefty, well-made, like you can just feel the quality. I mean, get it Pioneer Woman because she she's had some cute stuff before, but it's been a little bit dated for me <laughs> um, to get into. But this stuff, it's like, it's like vintage done right. Like I remember my grandmother had all sorts of like glassware similar to this, but it was in that awful milky jade color. And to me, like, I'm sorry if you like it. I hate it though. Like I, ugh, I hate it. Or it was in this amber color or clear. Like I just could, I could never get behind it. But with this teal color, I am about it. And what I'm gonna show you next is I'm about it too. <laughs> I saw this and my heart just melted. Okay, like it is this, they have, they have these in the teal first of all. So if you love the teal, they have them. I think they have them in clear and then they have them, I think in like a, like a more, like an actual blue color, like a more of a, not electric blue, but like a true blue rather than the teal color. But the rose, uh, it gives me everything I was ever wanting out of these glasses. And these are so hefty. Like, I don't even know. Like these things, it's gonna take a lot to actually break one of these. Like they are true in that vintage style. Like they are thick glass, they are hefty, they are well made. And I was like, this from Walmart? This from Walmart? <laughs> like Walmart is stepping their game up. Like it used to be very like, you got what you paid for, you know? Like it was very like, kind of cheap and that's why people went there like to to get more affordable prices but you got a lesser quality as well they aren't playing with these and granted it is by pioneer woman so maybe she didn't you know she was like i'm gonna make them how i make them but she knocked it out of the park with these so this comes in a set of four and it's under twenty dollars so it's about five dollars a glass so uh, I ordered four because I wanted to just, or not just one set of four, I should say that, not four sets. <laughs> That's a lot of glasses. But anyway, I pulled them out of the package and I was like, oh my God, I'm so in love with these. They are so fantastic, so well made. I've been looking to replace my glassware because some have broken over the years. It's getting very like eclectic, which I don't like. So I'm uh, gonna be going through that and then putting some into a, like a garage sale and replacing with most of these. So I ordered some more of these. But yeah, 20 bucks for four of them is not that bad. So for this kind of quality where it's gonna really, really last, I'm, I'm here for it. 
Then while I was looking at those glasses, of course, another style of glass, which is like a goblet popped up. This is what I'm currently drinking my water out of y'all and I feel bougie as hell. Anyway, again, same thing with these, super well made, freaking gorgeous. Like look at the detail on that. Love the little like scalloped ball here and the foot of the, the glass here. So stinking cute. Um, I think I'm gonna, sorry, my lip balm's on there. I think I'm gonna order another set of four of these because I only got one set because I was like, oh, I don't know. And then I was like, I was kind of unsure of them when they first came in because I'm like, are they too much? No, <laughs> they're not. <laughs> So like ultimately like I had a girls night last night these came in yesterday or just, like I washed them in the dishwasher and then um, had them for wine night and like my my be one of my besties Nicole was like girl where'd you get these glasses and I was like Walmart and she's like the hell Walmart you serious so like she was shocked too but um and she was like, and I was like, but are they too much? And she's like, hell no, they're not too much. What are you talking about? They are fantastic. I've been eyeballing these. I was on Amazon, put something similar in my cart. And I was like, you know what? That just reassured me that I was spot on. And so obviously I need more, you know? So four is not enough because what if one breaks, you know? So I think I'm going to order another one. They also come in teal and they also come in another blue um, color as well. And... This one also comes in an even darker purple color, um, clear and teal. So that's what I pulled up. So overall, I'm just so obsessed with this type of glassware. It's just giving me everything I ever needed. <laughs> So um, on to the next items, but that's everything that I'm obsessed with right now, like hardcore obsessed with and have picked up from Walmart. Um, again, highly impressed with it. So had to let you guys know in case you are down with that same style. And the last thing that I picked up, I actually got two of these. So this is the medium size. This is also from Better Homes and Gardens, but it's just like a clear acrylic bowl. Um, so this is great for, I mean, a multitude of things, right? You can use bowls for like everything. So beautiful for like a salad where you can see the colors through it. Great for like chips, for a uh, party all sorts of different things you can do with these. So I got the medium size, which is only like $7. I'm rounding up because I don't do change. I hate that crap. And then I got the bigger one. This one is, okay, so this was like a nine inch one. And then this one's like an 11 or 12 inch. So I got the bigger one. Um, this one is like eight, I think eight or $9. And then this one was like seven. So I can't find this one online. So I'm just basing it off of my memory here. And overall, I just thought they were like, they were just like classic. Like they're never gonna go out of style. They're just clear, but they have a little bit more interest to them than just being a plain clear bowl. Like it makes them look a little bit more elevated. So overall, those are my Walmart finds. I am digging Walmart's style right now with their, like just really like their kitchen stuff, their entertaining stuff, their glassware, their dishware, all of that good stuff. And hopefully I think later in the year, I am gonna give them another shot with their clothing. But overall, their kitchen stuff is winning for sure. So comment down below if you have checked out the kitchen stuff at Walmart recently. Have you seen the Pioneer Woman glasses? Um, overall, I'm just finding such good things for like entertaining and just when I'm, you know, phasing out some old stuff that I've had for a really long time and just kind of replacing it with newer, um, more updated items or things that are just appealing to my style more recently. They seem to have it. So even above like Target or most other stores. So good job, Walmart. All right, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button, join the Thick Girl Gang, and give this video a thumbs up. We'll see you next time. Bye, guys.